We've got fire already. Why have we got fire? How did that happen? This is Cruise Ship Manager, an upcoming tycoon game where you get to manage every aspect of a cruise ship. We are going to be trying this out today. This is the playtest. Uh, the full game will be coming out sometime in 2023. I'll leave a link to it in the description down below. You have until, I think, the 3rd of August 2022 to try out the playtest. So, let's jump in. Now, there is quite a catchy sort of... Um, tune in the menu here. But anyway, we only get to choose one ship in the playtest demo. This is the Sammy, a small cruise ship. Here we go. I'm going to play the tutorial again. Right. Welcome to Cruise Ship Manager. This is the Harbour Options panel. Here you can switch between the different modes and so to start a cruise. In the Cruise Planner mode, you can plan the route and the destination of your cruise. In Build mode, you can modify your ship and place new rooms. In the Crew Employment mode, you can select who to employ. And in the tickets mode, you can manage the sales of the tickets for your cruise. Okay. Right, cruise planner. We're going to do that. So we got to choose where we want to go. And I think we're going to go down to here to Bombay. Because you can either go up here to like, I get Archangel, I think it's called. But you, get, you actually get better reward for this cruise. I know it's more difficult, but um, I'd, I'd much rather go on a cruise to Bombay than up into the middle of an Ar the Arctic, right? So here we go. Build mode. So here we are. To build a new room, select a category from the menu at the bottom of your screen and choose which room you would like to build. Then simply place it in any free spot on your ship. Remember that all rooms on, the, on your ship must be connected using corridors or the elevator so that your crew and passengers can reach them. Okie dokie. Crew cabin. So we're going to put a crew cabin down here. Good job. You've successfully built your first room on your cruise ship. In this demo, the number of passengers and crew uh, the ship can take depends on the number of cabins that you provide for them. The more cabins you build, the more passengers and, and crew uh, can be on the ship. The number of passengers and crew is displayed at, at the top panel. Okay, so up here, right. I mean, that's passengers and that's crew, right. Each passenger has their own needs and it is our responsibility to ensure that they are met. Hunger first, sleep and entertainment are some of the most important needs, not to mention knowing where the nearest toilet is. Make sure that your ship has cabins for uh, your passengers and at least one restaurant, club and bathroom. Okay, each room has a specific number of work slots to, be, to which a crew member needs to be assigned. Try to have more crew than work slots. Um, to ensure that all work slots are always occupied by a crew member. Okay, so we're going to have... Well, there's four crew slots there. Uh, can we put a... We can put a... Hang on a minute. There you go. A corridor there. Perfect. Perfect. Now, I also want to get an elevator here. There we go. Right, so... I think we should have more crew cabins, honestly. Let's have some more. Where are the crew cabins? Let's have... Let's have four. Yeah, four crew cabins. I think that sounds about right. Four crew cabins. So that is... Eight. Eight crew can be on the ship. Right, and now we need to do the, um, the passengers. So, we're going to start them out up here. There's one. And then we're going to go like that. Now we can also put a... Actually, can we make this into an elevator? No, we can't. It's too big. There we go. Um, now we're going to have a two cell there. And we're going to do just another again. Oh god, where they gone? Um, like that. There we go. And we'll do one more. I want it to be relatively high capacity. Just because it's quite a long cruise, right? Okay, now on the floor above, we're going to have the posh cabins. These two, these bigger ones. So they're, they still only take two people, but the quality is like a star higher. So yeah, we'll get some better um, or higher price tickets for these. Right, so like that. And then like that. Okay, and then we're going to put another one just here. Like... So, let's keep going with these. Let's see if we can keep going. Um, if I put, like, can we put a, a room right next to an elevator? I think we can. So if I put it... No, you can't. You can't put a room right next to an elevator. So what I need to do now is click this button. I click cell room, then other. I can put a two cell there. Huh? 
Oh, I know why. Because these aren't connected to anything yet. Right, okay, so that's fine. So, I will probably be able to do that. I'm just going to put the cabin back. Can we fit another in? I think we actually can fit another in. Yeah, we actually can. Right, so I'm going to put... Maybe we can put one in. No, it's too big, too big. That one there, and then we can just put a... One cell in. There we go, they're all connected now. Perfect. Right, so we've got... One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine rooms. I'll put one more room in, and we'll put it um, on this floor. Maybe you can fit one in here. I mean, someone would get a very nice room there, wouldn't they, if they, if they weren't there and they can't fit. Um, we'll, put, we'll put that one in. There you go. That looks perfect to me. So now we need to have the restaurant, and the restaurant's going to go up here. They're going to have a nice view out the front. Oh, there are only windows, but... If there were windows there, they have, they'd have an amazing view. Uh, entertainment, well, we need a club. And the club's just going to go there. Now we need some toilets. It's going to be important to have toilets. So we're going to put the toilets there. Um, as well as, why not, a, a male toilet. Mm, uh, see, the rooms don't have toilets. That's kind of weird, isn't it? A male toilet there and a female toilet there. There we go, perfect. Right, so now what else do we need? We could have a casino. But it won't fit anywhere now because it's too big. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to move this. Where would this go? There, I guess. Yep. We're going to put the casino in. Oh, really? It doesn't fit. No, leave it, leave it, leave it, leave it. We don't need the casino in. It's not, it's not necessary. Um, is that all? I think it is. So that is perfect. Okie dokie, let's get going. So under the crew employment tab, this is the crew employment tab. Here you can select who to work, for, um, who to hire for your ship's crew. Next to it is a list of uh, available hires. Double click one to employ. Okay, we're going to do this. Right, we need someone that's good at gastronomy. They can be our chef. Um, sort by gastronomy. Right, Alex Banana is a good name. Um, now we need someone by service. Suzanne Pear. Entertainment. Oh, they're good at gastronomy as well. Um, what about engineering? Um, efficiency. You. Just going to get an all-rounder sort of people. We've got six staff. I'm going to hire one more underneath engineering again. There you go. Right. That looks good to me. Tickets. The price of the tickets largely depends on your reputation. A high reputation will convince more people to purchase expensive tickets, while a lower reputation will, would need a lower price or an advert to put in customers. Once you're satisfied with your price, uh, select sell tickets. Once you've sold the tickets, you will no longer be able to modify anything about the cruise, including selecting the route and building rooms. Right. Are we happy with the, with the number of passengers? We could probably increase the number of passengers a bit more. So that's what I'm going to do. We're going to fill this thing up. There we go. A free cell and then a one cell. We've got a big corridor there. Um, eight staff. We're going to get a bit more for eight than eight. And then we can put a little room down here, I guess. Uh, where is it? Cabins. Can we have a big one down here? No. We'll have one of these. There you go. Right, we're nearly done. We are nearly done. Um, I think that will be fine. Uh, we could, of course, have one here, but that's right next to a room, isn't it? We'll have one here. A kind of a cabin like that. Huh? We can't. Run out of money. Run out of money. Okay, fine. Tickets. Right, so we're going to have an all-inclusive. 900. Flyers and a newspaper ad. And then we're going to sell. Ready? 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10... 11. Are we going to sell 12? I think we are. Come on. No, we didn't quite sell 12. Okay, well, that's fine. Back to the harbour. Set sail. You won't be able to go back to expand the ship again. Okay, right. The ship has departed. The key to ensuring a successful cruise and making the most profit is making sure your passengers are happy. Stay vigilant during the cruise and events may occur. Uh, in order to maintain the ship, you need to assign crew members to their work slots Restaurants and clubs. The bridge, the engine, all need workers in order to keep uh, the ship sailing. 
double click or hover your cursor and press the blue cogwheel button on one of these rooms in order to manage the rooms, uh, open the rooms management panel. Okay. So we've got to go up here. Room management. This is the rooms management panel. Here you can assign crew members to work slots, manage prices and resources, and see the passengers' options. Okay, review panel in order to do, 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 do. So, crew assigned. Choose a captain. Um, who do we need? Should we do safety? You. You're going to be the captain. We've <laughs> just assigned a random person as the captain. Okay, so we need a chef. You're perfect. Uh, and we need a waiter. You're perfect. Okay. We only need one of those, I guess. Is that okay? I think that's okay. Right, so now entertainment. A DJ? Oh. You're fine? No. Entertainment. Oh no, hang on a minute. Oh no. There you go. And a barman. We'll need a service expert here. Is Suzanne Pear not doing anything? They are assigned, yeah. You. Right. It says they need more. Unit price, 75. Wait is not assigned. Need to assign another one. Right, then you. Is that all? No. Do, do we really need all the chefs? I think we actually did. Right, now we've got a problem. I don't think we've got enough people for this. Ah. I've messed this up. Engineering. We've got fire already! Why have we got fire? Why have we got fire? How did th How did that happen? Someone extinguish! Go! No! How's that happened already? Come on! Are they going? I, I don't know. I don't know what's going on. They're not going. Uh, and we're setting sail, but the ship's on fire. What's that out to sea? It's like a crate. Why is it? Why is there junk in the sea? Uh oh. This is really bad. The ship's on fire. Um. Right. Okay, I need to unassign them. So if I unassign them from this. We don't need all the waiters there, come on. There we go, they're going, they're going, right, we're doing it. Yay! They're actually putting it out, okay. I think I needed more crew. I needed more crew. There you go, look, they're nearly out, nearly out. Did we not have someone at the engineer slot? It'll have to be you, won't it? Oh, they didn't. They didn't finish putting it out though. Um, fire in the room. Yep, yep. I know. I know. I know. There you go. They put it out. Right. Perfect. Okay. Right. You get down to the um, the engineer room. Right. Where's my crew list? Is everyone working? Is everybody working? I think they are. Yep, you're assigned, you're assigned. You're not. So I'll assign you there as well. Right, what problems do we have? We have a problem up here. We need a barman. I needed more crew, didn't I? Okay, well... Whoa, well, what the heck? There's a, there's a raft out there. Right, okay. Parties, passengers. I think they're all happy. Some of them are. We need to dock at the port. Oh, you will start a new game? No, 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 no. Right, so top tip, you need to get as many crew as possible. Because I just completely failed there. That they're having a party. They're not all happy, are they? I don't think we really need two people down here, so I'm just going to unassign you. And you're going to get up here into the, into the restaurant. Be our second waiter. There you go. Ignore the club. They do want drinks though, look. They do want drinks. Um, well, is anyone in their cabins? I don't think they actually are. 
So here we go. Let's um, do eight times speed. We're making our way. Have we got? A, have we got like a map or something? We can disable back walls, and you can see through to the corridors. The people are actually sleeping. Um, and the the restaurant's going well now. But <laughs> look at that guy on the dance. Look at the look at the way. Oh no! Not again! Not again! That guy on the dance floor. He was really busting a move. Right. We got a fire. Well, well I wouldn't walk that way. He's, he's scared, he's scared. What's he doing? He's getting in bed, laying the wrong way in bed. Um, I need to get someone... I can't, I can't unassign the captain. Let's unassign this person. You. Put this damn fire out. There you go, go! Go! Where are they? What? No! It's here! You need to go that way. Oh no, they're already there. Nice. What a, what a disaster. Okay. Eight times speed, they're putting it out. They're putting it out very slowly. But, um... There we go, right. I can assign you back in here now. Alex Banana. Right. So, almost got a bit of a, um, a failure there. There is a problem in this toilet. Oh, no. It's, like, really dirty. Um, yes, okay. Are any of them available? Don't think they are. Did I really only ca get that many... People in the crew? Is that that's crazy? Let's go for Claudia Banana. Look, we can get rid of a waiter right now. Do we need two cooks? I'm going to risk not having two cooks, right? Claudia Banana, here we go. Oh no. The rooms are like really dirty. Wow. Go on then, you clean the rooms now. Yeah, look, they're cleaning. No, what? Okay, whatever. He just wants to get in there. They're clean. Go. Oh, my goodness. The ship... <laughs> What's going on with this ship? What is going on with this ship? It's really odd. And all the rooms are, like, disgusting now. Well, look, it was my first try... Um, at this game and I have to say I am really enjoying it But I did make a crucial mistake in that I didn't have enough staff on my ship complete fail, but um, When this game is out, I will come back to it. I am interested in it It is the kind of game I do like playing. I like playing a game called Hotel Giant back in the day Which reminds me quite a lot of that um, Can we stop that noise? No, we can't. Oh dear. Let's dock at the port. Come on. There we go. Wow Well, I completely failed there but um, I hope you enjoyed that video. If you want to check out the playtest, you've got until the 3rd of August to check it out. I'll leave a link to it in the description down below. A fun game. Um, I'm looking forward to it coming out. It does seem to be quite well made. Maybe it needs to explain a little better what you need to do. It did say get as many staff as you need, but I didn't know actually how many staff I needed. For example, I didn't know that the restaurant would take four people alone. That's craziness. Um, but yeah, from me, if you enjoyed that video, make sure to give it a like. Let me know what you think about this game in the comments down below. Check out my channel memberships uh, from the join button if they start at $1.99 per month. And come over to my Discord server where we have an ongoing game giveaway for a Steam code. I believe it's for Railway Empire. And I will see you soon for some more simulator adventures. Make sure to join my Discord server from the link in the description. Simulator Adventures channel memberships are available from as little as $1.99 per month and grant you access to exclusive perks including members only videos. Click the join button below this video to find out more. Special thanks to Ultra Sim fan Oh My Mandy.